Good morning. I've got to get these logs out of here. I've got several logs that I really can't do much with. I'm sure there's some decent wood here on the ends. But I'm telling you, it's just, it's just going to be too much work for me to just kind of whittle off that, you know, all the root the root rot that this tree has, this red oak has. I'm gonna put this on the back of my forks of my tractor here. Attempt to put it on the back of my forks and get it out of here and put it in the woods somewhere. That's what I'm hoping to do. See if I can even move this thing around. Yeah, that's gonna be. tractor will lift it. Alright. My forks won't dig underneath this this log so I'm gonna have to roll it over. this up a little bit here. I have a feeling it's going to want to slide right off. I have a feeling. Thank <laughs> you. 
up down. This one's a similar size, maybe a little smaller. I need to give y'all some footage of me. Jump it in the woods. Oh, this is much easier. Much lighter. I think I can do it without it being chained up. I think so. Maybe I'll put two logs on there. Yeah, well. It's not bad. Move the camera down there so you can see me dump it. that or not. <laughs> you know, it's probably enough. I'll probably slide my forks underneath it that's what I'm hoping we get out of here well it all worked out the old Ford Jubilee did it again Got rid of my logs, so it's a little cleaner looking over here. I still got some of these rounds I need to I need to process a little further. Probably make them into the the tiny, precious tiny wood for the Mesa stove or pizza oven. Anyway, headed back to my parents' house to store my tractor. And then I'm gonna head back to the wood yard with my truck. And I'm gonna load it up full of firewood because this past weekend was it was uh, pretty chilly, and I used a lot of firewood in both of my indoor fireplaces. There's some pine over here, some fine pine. How we looking? How we looking with the pine? Tiny little pieces. Southern yellow pine. Got a little cedar mixed in. I don't know if y'all can see the cedar up here at the top a little bit. This is some cherry that is just the fungal growth lives the cherry. So I try to get in the sun as much as I could. That's dry wood, but 